Hello there my lovely attractive subscribers, this is Chris and Craft here to teach you how to add a Minecraft pre-release um, to your Minecraft so you can play all the brand new developmental versions of the full game of Minecraft. Jeb releases these uh, weekly, um, he fixes many bugs that are in Minecraft and you can go ahead and test it out for yourself. Now what you'll do is you'll go to this website here, it's the minecraftwiki.net, it'll be uh, linked down in the description below. You just go ahead, scroll down, the latest one is usually always on the top as you can see here. This one was released on January 5th which was 5 days ago. And if you want to uh, run it on your server, you can click on your server. And if you want to run it uh, as your single player, you just click client. So you click client, you let it download, so you just save file. As you can see, I've downloaded it already, so I'm just going to cancel this. Whoops. And um, and what you'll do is we'll just go into the folder here, and I have it open here. <clears throat> and I'll delete these other files just for, uh, especially for this tutorial. So this is the file that you download. It's actually a Minecraft.jar file. And what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and replace it with our current Minecraft.jar file. So let's just go there now. Uh, I have something called Minecraft Profile Manager. That's what I use to uh, keep track of my different uh, Minecrafts that I'm running. If you guys are interested in this, I have a tutorial on how to install it and that annotation will come here now. It helps keep track of like if you have different mods on different uh, um, Minecrafts and you want to keep it separate, you want to have a default Minecraft, you want to have a yog box, you want to have a bunch of different things, I use that. So I'll just open up my profile pre-releases and uh, hopefully you guys install that. I go to dot, my dot .minecraft folder, go into bin, and I already have a minecraft.jar folder in here. What I'm going to do is take this new minecraft.jar file that I've downloaded and just drag it right on in here and click move and replace just allow it just allow it to replace and uh, after that we'll just run it and see how it goes so I'll just go ahead open up my minecraft profile manager and this is the profile owner uh, run so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that and um, we just click log alright as you can see there's a bunch of new things on here um, You'll see this, you'll see a bunch of other things, but I am, I have a weekly series started um, that's, uh, that includes the many changes that happen throughout these pre-releases, so uh, stay tuned for that, uh, stay on my channel to look for that, like, favorite this, and subscribe, uh, leave a comment down below if you have any questions, um, this tutorial is now over, thank you very much for watching.